Look, all of this can't be hunky dory. Can you tell us where you can go wrong or where quantum mental investing can go wrong? Why should there be a case for anybody to invest in active fund management? What was justification or research that you did or a testing that you did? Most likely you would have done it on the past data. Now when there is a regime change what that means is whatever testing that you did on what you thought was effective may no longer be effective. A classic case is for example the crash during April March 2020 during the covid crisis, right? So at that point in time you're basically entering an unknown unknown territory and then obviously there are this unquantifiable aspects right for example things like promoter integrity corporate governance what has happened in the past with the promoter group there are certain aspects especially in india right where there's a limit to how much you can quantify some of these issues no one can quantify promoter honesty 